we just really need some answers. In our TV interview, Jennifer Faith appeared desperate for an arrest. If anybody knows anything, please contact the detective. But detectives believe she knew who killed her husband, despite what she told us. I just hope that at some point, maybe this person can recognize the gravity of what they've done and feel some sort of guilt enough to come forward. In early January, police arrested Faith's ex-boyfriend, Darren Lopez, and charged him with murder. Court documents say Jennifer texted and called Lopez more than 14,000 times the month her husband was killed. The documents show text messages where Jennifer admits she was having a full-blown emotional affair with Lopez. And investigators say they have the murder weapon proving he drove from Tennessee to Texas to kill Jamie Faith. After the murder, police released this image of the suspect's truck. Jennifer begged the public for help. Somebody has got to know whose truck this is because it was a, it's a black Nissan Titan extended cab. It had a, um, a Texas Ranger sticker in the back window. And so it's, it was very distinctive from that point. But just one day after our interview, court documents say she texted her ex-boyfriend saying, I woke up in a little bit of a panic. Something is eating away at me, telling me you need to take the sticker out of the back window of the truck. She texted him again the next day. I really think you need to get that sticker off ASAP. But at the time, investigators had already flown over Lopez's Tennessee home. And on his property was a Nissan Titan with the distinctive T in the back. Now he's charged with murder. Jennifer's charged with obstruction of justice. Nearly five months after the death of Jamie Faith. Now those court documents also show that Jennifer and her ex attempted to delete text messages related to the case in the past couple of the months. Now if convicted, Darren Lopez, her ex, faces the possibility of life in prison for that murder charge. Jennifer faces the possibility of 20 years. We're live in Dallas. I'm Alex Rozier.